طيب in this chapter we want to define what is the determinant of the matrix what is the determinant of the matrix طيب if you have any matrix like this let's start with a two by two matrix how we can find the determinant of the matrix just multiply this time that minus this time that do you remember when we got the inverse we have been multiplying the inverse صح لما نجي اجيب الانفرس لو كان 2 by 2 كنا بنقول 1 over AD minus BC and then here we D و A و minus B و minus C ده في الحالة بتاعت الانفرس الانفرس of A now what is this this is actually the determinant of the matrix so this one it is the determinant of the matrix. What is the determinant of this matrix, 2 by 2 matrix? A is equal to a determinant. We write like that. Determinant of A. Or we can write it determinant of A, like this. So it is equal to what? If it is 2 by 2 matrix, then AD minus BC. To find the inverse, that means a determinant should not equal to zero. لأنه ما عايزة ده يساوي zero. But this is the determinant. If this the determinant should not equal to zero. Yeah, one over the determinant of a. So لما نجي أعمل ال inverse, this actually هنا this part one over a determinant of a. Clear? For instance, this matrix. What is the determinant? Three fi three fi two by six minus 4 في minus 1 by minus 4. Well, minus sign, it got plus. Correct? It got 6 plus 4, which is 10. Clear? Type. Always, Zayma, when we are doing the inverse, the inverse for square matrix, if we want to get uh, I see and matrices, which kind of matrices being good symmetric or symmetric, in like square matrices, correct? Type also here for the determinant, we are doing it for uh, square matrices to find the determinant. Type for instance, what if it was the matrix, our matrix is three by three matrix? What we do, how we solve it, we solve it like that. If the matrix is two by two, I uh, three by three, for instance, take this number, al huwa A11, and then you multiply it times it is matrix. What is the matrix? You delete this and delete that. So take this one, al hi A22, A23, and A32, and A33. Okay, then here, this, the first element was plus, the second element was minus sign, the third one was plus sign. If I'm using this row, type, if I come minus A12 في matrix حقتها. Okay, what is the matrix? Now, I will, this one, take it out, and this one, take it out. So, it is, a21, A23, and then A31, and then A33. Okay. Actually, fit determinant hagata مش matrix hagata. Sorry. This is determinant. And this is determinant. And this one now it's two by two matrix uh, determinant. So I can find it as we had just a few minutes ago. And this one as well. We can calculate it. Remain the last one, and I'll take it with the plus sign. So, for the plus A13, A13, fit determinant, Hagata. Type what is the determinant of A13? We do this. So, it is A21, A22, and then A31, and then A32. So I'm done. You calculate this and then multiply it times that. Calculate this and multiply it by this. Calculate this. 
and then do the operation in a minus you've got this al ragam al bijih in a minus this one then plus this part so you'll get the determinant of the matrix clear so here for instance this is an example we want to find the determinant of this matrix so the determinant of this matrix our haja we use the lines like that ah huh? it's not like this it is just straight line so what is the determinant of this we start this is the nine if we take this out so five four two two so this one you can evaluate this taban and then an eight this with the plus this is with the minus this is with the plus okay so minus eight and you also delete this one and this one so six four three two and the seven and you do the same and then after that five feet two by ten ten minus eight it is two so nine times two what do the calculation and then you get the number so the a determinant of the matrix the dini a real value okay like that okay so scalar type um i can even find the determinant using any other row it's not necessarily just this one like i used it now for instance i can use this one as well to find the determinant and always the determinant you have you are going to get the same answer no matter row you used for here this is plus this is minus this is plus this is minus this is plus this is minus and this is plus this is minus okay and this is plus and etc type if i want this one so i do the same so it is three times what times you delete this one and delete this one so you're going to write eight seven five four and then in a minus two so minus two and then write the determinant and then at the end plus two and write its determinant and then do the calculation and find the answer the answer you will find that it's going to be also minus three so you could use any row to find the determinant and even not that when we're finding the determinant it's not like solving system of linear equation also you can use the column if you like like this one we can find the value of the determinant using any column either first or second or set but make sure this is plus minus plus so here this is minus and you will find at the end also this is plus and then you expand nine times and then you delete like this and delete like that so multiply times this one minus six and then again you delete like this and delete like that if get eight seven two two and etc and then you know at the end count okay and then you will find that it is minus three okay so is it clear how to find the three by three determinant and made a determinant of a three by three matrix okay type what if it is four by four the same okay but the steps are going to be more yeah and ms7 locan hina india um let's say masalan hina fi x y z and then um let's say here w okay and then uh, let me write masalan b c d so now what is it four by four what i do again take any row take any uh i yes take any row if you like if you muscle and you want to take this one you can take and then expand your matrix byte okay what do you do a two one fee what do you do delete this one and delete that one so it's going to be y correct a one two then a three two correct and then z 
A13, A33, and then W, and then uh -huh, um, B, and then you know, D. So, and then plus, now you go to A22, and then write the determinant as well, plus like this. And now what about this one? Now this is a determinant of three by three. What do you do? This is the Y. Yes. OK, so you do like that and this. So A21 multiplied open a big bracket like that. So Y times a matrix at determinant Hagata plus. And you continue like this and then after that you come and multiply this, but it's long. The other methods, yes, we're coming for that. Clear? Type. Now, we will have some properties that will make our, uh, uh, finding the determinant more easier. What is that? What are the rules? I'll tell you. Now, look at this. Uh, matrix. What is the determinant of this matrix? It's 2 pi 2, so 1 phi 4 by 4, 4 minus 6, which is minus 2. Type. Now look at this matrix and this matrix. What is the relation? Actually, the transpose of this matrix is this matrix. So this matrix is A transpose. Yeah. And here 1, 2, we get 1, 2. Correct? Type. Now calculate the determinant. 1, 3, 4, 4, 4 minus 6. It is again minus 2. So the first property is that. The determinant of the transpose of the matrix is the same as the value of the determinant of the matrix. Both, they will have the same value. Type. Second property. Type. This one. 1, 2, 3, 4. Find the determinant of this. We found that it is minus 2. Now, what is the relation of this matrix and this matrix? What is the relation of this matrix? We just interchange the row. This is 3, 4. I put it at the beginning and then 1, 2 at the end. Type. Now we evaluate this one. 3, 3, 2, base 6. 6 minus 4 is 2. OK, so here the result is 2, is minus 2, while here the result is 2. So that is what that is. When you interchange any two rows, OK, in a matrix, you will find that the determinant of the first is equal minus the determinant after the interchanging. Clear? OK, so this is OK my original matrix, okay, of oh, this is uh, the one I interchange, it is equal to minus a first value, so minus minus two, so it is two, okay? If interchanging two rows will give me the same result, but of the original, but with minus sign. Clear, okay, clear, okay. Type. Now, if two rows are equal, على فكرة في الماتر في في الديتيرمينت، we are talking about columns as well as rows. يعني here when I said interchanging, I interchange the rows. Can I interchange the columns? Yes. If you put two, four here and one and three here and go and do it as a homework, you will find that the new matrix has a determinant equal to minus this value and here two. So even if you interchange two columns, clear? Time. Now, if two rows are the same, our two columns are the same, are equal, then you will find that the determinant is equal to the zero. So go and try to find this determinant and simply 
I, if I were you, I'll use either this row or this column, because one of the elements is zero. So that will make the calculations more easy for me, correct? Yani لو أخذت دية, okay, this is with minus sign, this is with plus, this is with minus. So the one, I do remove this and then I remove that, correct? So it is one phi, one phi three minus three, one phi zero, correct? Then we do for the four with minus four, and then you multiply, you take this one, remove this one out and this one out. So one phi two minus two phi one, so it is minus two. So it is, uh, sorry, um, uh, two minus two, it is zero. So four phi zero, zero. So zero minus zero, it is zero. Okay, anyway. So always, if you have two equal rows, the determinant will be zero. Much equal rows, bardo. Equal columns, come on. Now can this three, four, three, مثلا, here three, four, three, from the first look, what is the determinant of this? Is going to be equal to zero. Why? I have two equal rows, or I have two equal columns. Clear? Okay. Moreover, if one of the rows is كل الالمنتس حقته ار زيروز اور وان كولوم كل الانتريز حقته ار زيرو ار زيروز ذن اجين ذا ديتيرمنت بتساوي زيرو لانه اي كان اكسباند يوزنج ذس وان زيرو في وامشي احكي كده وكده سو ات جيف مي زيرو اند ناو زيرو في اند اي دو ذس ات ويل جيف مي زيرو اند اكسترا بيكوز زيرو تايم اني ثينج ويز زيرو اوكي سو ذس از تو ثينجز ناو مور اوفر just give me two minutes. Then, moreover, now, what is this? This is our original matrix, and where we started with one, two, three, four. A determinant, we found that it is minus two. Type okay. So, one, two, three, four. Now, look at this matrix, our determinant. What is the relation between this and this one? Three, four, three, four. But this is 10 and this is 20. That is, we multiplied. This row, only one row by 10. So now we try to find this determinant. 10 times 4, 40. 40 minus 60. That is minus 20. Correct? The account be minus 2. But this one is minus 20. So when I multiply it one row times 10, okay? We found that the determinant is this value times 10. So multiplying one row by a number will result in the same value of the original determinant or, or original matrix, the determinant of the original times 10. So it is minus 20. You got it? So this is, is the same as 10 multiplied by the matrix which is this one type so, moreover i'll show you something now what do you think if this is this was 30 and this was 40 so that means what that means i multiplied the first times 10 and also the second times 10 this one Type. Now, what is the answer? 10 fee 40 before 100 minus 20, 30, 600. What is the answer? It is minus 200. What is the relation? So the same matrix, I'm, I'm sorry, a determinant is the same as this determinant, but multiplied times what? Times 100. And look at it, minus 200. Look at minus 2, and now it's minus 200. So times 10 phi 10. Okay. Okay. If I multiply it times 5. Okay. And here times 5, so 15. Here times 5, which is 20. Now, what is the determinant of this matrix? It is the same as the determinant of this matrix, but phi 1 row, comma, through phi 10 times the other row, phi 5. So 50 
times the minus two. Clear? So it's going to be minus hundred and try it. Is it clear? Type. If a matrix B is obtained from a matrix E, type NDD one, two, three, four. Okay, this is the three, four. This is the three, four. Now, what about this one? What about this one? 31, how I got it? I multiplied, I multiplied, okay? This one by 10 and add to it this, an arrow operation. So I got this one. And also I multiply this one, I multiplied, sorry, this one by 10 and add to and put it. So I changed the first row using the second row, okay, multiplying by 10 and then add the same row. Type now calculate this determinant. You will find that it is the same as this one. This is minus two and this is minus two. Ibga, if a matrix B is obtained from a matrix A by adding a multiple of one row of A to another row of A, then they will have the same determinant. Not this only. Hatta lo kam fil column. It's not just the rows like when we're solving the uh, system of linear equation. Here, when I'm talking about determinant, I'm considering rows or columns. Yani even if yani this with this, مثلا, I multiply this, let's say times 10, and then add to it this. So this is going to be what? 2 plus 10, so 12. And then 3, I multiply times 10, so 30. 30 plus 4, then this is going to be 34. Now calculate this one. It's going to be minus 2 as well. So if a matrix B is obtained from a matrix A by adding a multiple of one row, a column of A to another row, a column okay, of A, then they will have the same determinant. Clear? Is it clear? So the operations in rows and in columns. So, um, and this is easy. I just, Ashan, I want you to go. Okay, just I'll give this quickly. Now, if you have an upper triangular matrix like this, that is, this is the diagonal. Your elements are up. The below all are zeros. Just multiply. One, three, two, three, four. No need to do anything. Just multiply the diagonals. It is eight. Type. What if the matrix cannot lower? And here is zero, 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 and the numbers are here. What do you do? Just also multiply the diagonal. So look at upper triangular or a lower triangular. What is the determinant of it? This time, that time, this. Okay. Now, what if it is diagonal? Also, just multiply this time, that time, this. Okay. So we'll stop here till our uh, coming class. Uh, if you have any question, please know these properties well. Go through them before our coming class, uh, which is in Monday. Okay, and if you have any question, you can ask regarding uh, this chapter.